So we've looked at Otome visual novels. Well, now it's time to look at the other side of the coin. Today, we're going to take a look at 10 great Yuri visual novels on the Nintendo Switch. Now, what is Yuri? I hear you ask. Well, well, that just means you didn't watch our terminology video, which is just awkward. Go watch that. If you don't have time, it means girl on girl action. So, uh, everyone's a winner. I think we can all agree. Yes, Yuri visual novels are where a female main protagonist will romance female love interest. There are not that many on the Switch currently, so I think we need to do a service to the genre and promote them even more. Here are 10 that I can recommend. Before we jump in, please remember to subscribe to this channel. Once we get to 3,000 subscribers, we are giving away two Switch games, Lyrical 1 and 2, and Super Mash to one of you. Plus, you will help us grow and help spread the word of the wonderful world of VN. So, you know, do the world a favor, subscribe, hit that bell button. Synergia is a short Yuri visual novel from Spanish developer Radi Arts. It's a futuristic cyberpunk VN that's emulating a lot of Blade Runner but going even further with the sci-fi concept. Here you are a police officer down on their look, who the world seems to hate. But then comes along a state-of-the-art android called Mara, who is given to you by a friend. Despite a short runtime, this tries to pack in a lot of twists and turns plot threads and conspiracies, and while it doesn't work 100% of the time, it's a quick VN to get a sci-fi fix. Brilliant synth soundtrack alongside some awesome artwork and colouring. I'm personally looking forward to the free update that's coming soon to help tie up and make a more satisfying ending. This is available on PC, Switch, PS4 and Vita. The Vita version saw a physical release and the Switch will do in the future once the update has gone live, so keep an eye out for that. Yumiya Tutu has two visual novels on the Nintendo Switch, the remaster of the original game and a fan disc called Re-After. Remaster follows the story of a young country girl called Ai, coming to the big city to join a game development company whose estranged sister also conveniently works at. What follows is a story of Ai trying to reconnect with her sister while also getting deep into the different facets of video game development. It has beautiful artwork and a handful of some cheeky CGs. I mean, the girl taking a bath in the sink will be forever etched into my brain. The re-after fan disc contains after stories for all the main love interests. Not quite as essential, but these can be bought separately on the eShop or if you buy the Japanese physical version, they are bundled together for an affordable price. And that Japanese version does have English, so it's great for importing for physical fans. And if you do want to do that, please check the link below in the description, as that is where you can purchase it and also support me and my writers at the same time. We are not monetized as of yet, even if YouTube cheekily still puts ads on our videos to earn money for itself. Thank you, YouTube. In terms of English, this was also released on the PS4 and PS Vita, only the Asian versions of those physicals have English, not the Japanese ones. Or you can just buy digitally, we have store credits below too. Seabed is a really interesting and unique story that delves deep into human psychological themes. The plot follows Mizuno Sachiko, a girl that has been looking for her partner who mysteriously disappeared without a trace. It's important to keep in mind that this is a kinetic visual novel, so there are no choices to be made, and its slow pace and extensive prose might be a put-off for some. But if you can look past that and let yourself become immersed in its world, it will deliver a story that's like nothing out there. It uses one of the rarer presentations in visual novels, NVL, meaning the text covers pretty much all of the screen. This is actually a Switch console exclusive, but is available on the PC too. Physically, this was made available by Play Asia as an exclusive, uh, but as it was limited, it's long sold out. Fatal 12 is a story that starts with your death. You are given a chance of cheating your death by a goddess who invites you to take part in a ritual called Divine Selection, as you compete with 11 others who have also lost their lives too early. You have to eliminate the other contestants by gathering information about them, basically a Yuri version of Danganronpa, although perhaps slightly less edgy. This is a visual novel filled with very memorable supporting characters, even if the main protagonist is a little on the bland side. And for those looking for pure Yuri, may be left wanting as this is a very plot-heavy game focusing on the issues at hand rather than the characters' relationships. This was made available physically on the Switch by Limited Run Games, and digitally is also available on PS4 and PC. 
Heart of the Woods is a highly regarded Yuri visual novel made in the West by Studio Ilan. This is regarded as one of the best of its kind in both aspects, Western and Yuri. Running in at less than 9 hours, this story tells of two paranormal investigators, Maddie and Tara, as they travel to a remote village that is hiding a secret. That secret is Abigail, a girl killed hundreds of years ago, now wandering the woods with unfinished business. It manages to pack in a lot very successfully for such a short runtime. And of course, the Nintendo Switch version is the All Ages Edition, whereas there is a patch for the PC version that can add explicit content if that's what you desire in your Yuri VNs. If Downton Abbey or Pride and Prejudice was a Yuri visual novel, then you'd probably end up with something like A Little Lily Princess. This Victorian era visual novel stars young Sarah who joins a boarding school and tries to make friends. In actual fact, it's based off a real novel called A Little Princess. It has elements of a dating sim as you raise your stats, but mostly it just tells a really lovely story with an incredibly charming main protagonist in Sarah who comes from a mixed background. She's half French, grew up in British India, and is now in England trying to be made into a prim and proper woman. Aside from the Switch, this is also available on PS4, PS5, Xbox, and PC. Both Nurse Love games are on the Nintendo Switch, Nurse Love Addiction and Nurse Love Syndrome, both of which, as you can imagine, are nurse themed. They are part of the same series but follow different stories, so you don't need to play one before the other if you don't want to. Both follow the stories of fresh out of education nurses making their way into the professional world. A nice balanced mix of slice of life stuff with medical jargon and of course plenty of romance with plenty of endings in each of the games. The unique setting truly sets it apart and makes it almost a character of its own. These are available physically on the Nintendo Switch 2 in North America and Asian regions which does have English by the way. And the physical is a nice affordable double pack of both games called Nurse Love Obsession which you will probably be obsessed with by the time you finish these two beasts. Links are below if you want to purchase it physically. And finally, let's end with Strawberry Vinegar. This is a cutesy, not so serious, light-hearted Yuri visual novel that centers on what else but food, featuring unique looking protagonists, one of whom is a demon who is always hungry. Let's face it, you'll probably be more interested in the food designs on show than the actual Yuri content here. I mean, I got hungry just looking at the screenshots while writing the script. So yeah, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna end it here and go uh, grab some lunch. This is available on all major consoles. And there we have it, 10 lovely Yuri visual novels for you all to sample on your Nintendo Switch. It is a small sample, but there is some big hitters in there mixed in with some indie stuff, Western VNs. It's actually quite a diverse list, I have to say. If you'd like to purchase the ones physically, as mentioned, please check the description of this video and the pinned comment where you can buy them and support BN Paradise at the same time. Please also subscribe so we can grow and talk more about visual novel stuff to the world. Check out our Otomi Switch list as well as plenty of other VN content for you to consume. We shall see you guys over there. Have a good one.